Hey guys, Jesse for Gold Tech. Hey, we just got done wrapping up our weekend out here gold washing, or dry washing, gold washing, hopefully we're gold washing. And uh, got to thinking about how the dry washer works because of liquefaction. When this is vibrating, the, gold, the dirt is running down and liquefaction is what helps make that dirt flow like water. So we happen to forget our water to, to clean up with. So got me thinking. Gold claw kind of works the same way underwater. Will it work without water? So I'm gonna give it a try. Let's see if we got anything. So kind of stratify your material like you would underwater. Put all that gold down to the bottom. And then Kind of let your lights run off. Now, full disclo disclosure: these are our tailings from our our concentrates from our dry washer. So, just full disclosure. Shake everything back to the other side. Now we're going to use these smaller riffles over here. So again, well, we'll take the 22 out of there. I don't think I'm going to take any more of those home. And again, your lights are going to walk over those small, those bigger riffles, and hopefully hold back any gold. Another 22. Don't need that. go. I don't know if you guys can see that there. Nice little picker. Hopefully some fines in there. Let me kind of tap that back out of the way. There's a little flake right there. I don't know if the camera can pick that up or not. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, dry panning with the gold claw. Seems to work. All right. Good, good luck out there in the gold fields, guys. Thanks.